வெல்கம் பேக் டு டைம்ஸ் லைட் இன்ஃபோ ஏஎம்சிஏ ப்ரோக்ராம் இஸ் ஒன் ஆஃப் த மோஸ்ட் கிரிட்டிக்கல் ஒன்ஸ் த்ரூ விச் இந்தியா இஸ் டெவலப்பிங் அ ஃபிஃப்த் ஜென்ரேஷன் ஸ்டெல்த் மல்டிரோல் காம்பேக்ட் ஃபைட்டர் ஈவன் தோ தி இந்தியன் ஏர்ஃபோர்ஸ் ஹேஸ் அக்செப்டட் த கிரிட்டிக்கல் டிசைன் ரிவ்யூ த அப்ரூவல் பை த கேபினட் கமிட்டி ஆன் செக்யூரிட்டி இஸ் வெரி மச் ரெக்வைர்ட் இன் ஆர்டர் டு இன்ஃபியூஸ் ஃபண்ட்ஸ் டு பிகின் த ஃபேப்ரிகேஷன் அண்ட் டு ப்ரொசீட் வித் த பில்டிங் ஆஃப் ப்ரோட்டோடைப்ஸ் த பாயிண்ட் டு நோட் ஹியர் இஸ் தட் even if hindustan aeronautics limited an aeronautical development agency gets the clearance of the ccs it would take at least 3 years to develop a prototype and then plan for the first flight which will again take another 1 to 1.5 years developing a fifth generation is very much important for india but by the time the production of amc gets kicked off it would be like indian air force had to operate with a smaller number of fighter squadrons and also that too without any fifth generation fighters another discussion has come up which might delay the amc development is to see if the amc fighters really needs an internal cannon an internal cannon would be very useful during the dog fighting scenarios based on the review and the real time evaluation of such internal cannons on fighters it has been noted that such usage of internal cannons causes potential damage to the fuselage which affects the stealth characteristics of the fighter until the damage is fixed or repaired the utilization of internal cannon has not given satisfactory results on fighters like F22 and F35 fighters manufactured by Lockheed Martin of the United States usage of cannons has become inaccurate over time and also their extensive usage has led to cracking issues That's one of the main reasons for which both China and Turkey have excluded the fitting of internal cannons on their stealth fighters like J20 and TFX Khan. According to me the Indian Air Force can go ahead with AMC a design without the internal cannon since during current evolving air combat scenarios the role of a gun is diminishing rapidly and engaging fast maneuvering targets with such cannons has become more challenging. I'll keep tracking the progress made on this particular inclusion of internal cannon for the AMCA and will upload more videos then and there. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned to Tainsley Info for more defense and aviation related updates. Thank you.